Well, hey there, YouTubers. I'm going to show you, I uh, came across this comic book collection yesterday. I was digging through those boxes, had the old pictures and all, and uh, these were all wrapped up in there. It's quite a cool collection. And all these are from the 20s and 30s. And uh, they're in decent shape. I mean, they're for being, you know, almost 100 years old. Binding's loose in a lot of them. This one's got some writing up on top. It's missing the cover. That's actually the very first one. If that one was in good shape and had the cover, it'd be worth quite a bit. I did see this Clancy. Up, I looked it up on eBay. It's a second series. Uh, this one brought about 60 bucks. These other ones are bringing 20, 30, 40 bucks, you know, depending on condition. And uh, they're not in the best condition, but for the age, not too bad. So I decided if I'm going to take these to the uh, antique auction or I'm going to actually sell these on eBay. Uh, I don't like selling this kind of crap on eBay because uh, you get the people that they want it in perfect condition and you try to you explain you know, on the ads that it's, you know, whatever, whatever the condition issues are and uh, they still bitch. So Probably going to take these just to the antique auction. Like I said, we've got a little bit of writing on them. And, uh, collectors don't like that. This one was the one I liked the best. It was in the best shape, but uh, the binding's coming loose. As you can see here, it's all pulled apart. It's loose in here. So most people on eBay, they're gonna they're gonna bitch, even though if you point that out. So probably this will go as a lot at the antique auction. Hopefully, you get in a hundred bucks or so for it. Definitely let you know how it goes.